Welcome back to another video. It's not actually a tutorial. It's just a video that I'm uploading here. I'm republishing something that I did eight years ago forever in the YouTube world. It, it was not even on YouTube. Eight years ago, I did my very first tutorial. Funny enough, it was with Cinema 4D, Cinema 4D. And it's really strange that I'm coming back to Cinema 4D now. But I think uh, I thought it's uh, the, 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 the last day, my last chance to republish this since Game of Thrones is coming to an end. And back then I did model a 3D font, font pack uh, based on the popular movie font Trajan. If you do not know Trajan, um, there was a time where every movie poster was made with Trajan. It was really overdone. And there's a funny video called Trajan the Movie Font. Um, you, should, you should watch that one. And based on that, I, I did model a 3D font pack. I did the whole alphabet. It was my very first tutorial. I did sound, I did sound very strange and insecure and nervous. <laughs> uh, some say I still do. Really, not today, but years later, four or five years, I was still getting messages. Hey, where's that font pack? Where's I can't download it. So I thought now is the chance for a final re-upload on YouTube. I actually call this one of my biggest mistakes. Why? It's because um, I did that tutorial and then I never, I did, I didn't do another one for years. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't follow that path. Uh, in retrospect, I, uh, I do regret that. But <laughs> shoulda, coulda, woulda. Now we're here and now I'm giving it to you. Go ahead and download. It's not exactly, it's not exactly like Game of Thrones, but it's definitely based on Trajan. Like when we look at it now, that's what it would look like. Um, I'm giving it to you as a Cinema 4D release 20 project file and as an OBJ file. The funny thing is when you export OBJs, uh, um, export that as OBJ from Game uh, from <laughs> not Game of Thrones, Cinema 4D, then it, it kind of uh, screws up the pivot point. You have to re-center that within Cinema 4D and probably in other 3D in other 3D packages as well. So I don't know. I remember back then there was a program, a plugin called what was it called? Uh, Riptide, and that was kind of helpful when exporting OBJs. But if you, uh, if there's a better way to export natively from Cinema 4D, please, please let me know. But it should be possible. It should be easy to just readjust the pivot point. Okay, and then uh, since it's an OBJ, you can use it in Element 3D and Blender and whatnot, whatever 3D package you're using, and then can go ahead and design your own Trajan 3D letter cinematic intro title. That's basically it. I'm going to head over to the other room and watch the final episode now. No spoilers. <laughs> What's the final episode? It's coming to an end. I can't believe it. Hope you like it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.